Good evening, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to the September 8th uh, business meeting of the Daytona Beach Community Redevelopment Agency. We're happy to have you with us this evening. This time, Ms. LaMagna will review the procedures for tonight's meeting. Good evening. Agendas are available on the table in the lobby and at the front of the commission chambers. All the exhibits pertaining to items on the agenda are posted in the lobby. Please feel free to view the exhibits at any time during tonight's meeting. You are required to fill out a blue form to speak before the Community Redevelopment Agency. Forms are available on the table in the lobby and in the front of the commission chambers. You must complete the sections that ask for your name, address, topic of concern, agenda item number, signature and date. The form must be completed and placed in the designated box. Resolutions under administrative items number six are open for public comments and you may fill out a blue form to speak when that item is called. All citizens completing a blue form will be allowed to speak for three minutes. When you approach a lectern, please speak clearly into the microphone and give your full name and address. The three minute clock on the monitor above and directly in front of you will start running when you begin to speak. Pay close attention to your time. You will be told when your time has expired. Disorderly conduct in the public meeting of the City Commission. Article 2, Section 6238 of the City Code of Ordinances reads as follows. It shall be unlawful for any person to behave in a riotous or disorderly manner in any public meeting of the City Commission or any committee, agency, or board thereof, or to cause any unnecessary disturbances therein by force, shouting, or any other action that is calculated to disrupt such meeting or to refuse to obey any ruling of the presiding officer or such meeting relative to the orderly process thereof. Please be courteous and respectful of the views of others. Personal attacks on the Community Redevelopment Agency, city staff, or members of the public are not allowed. Please silence cell phones and other wireless devices during the meeting. All conversation must take place either at the election or on the dais so that everyone can hear the business being discussed tonight. Ms. LaMagna, may we have a roll call? Commissioner May? Here. Commissioner Cantu? Here. Commissioner Henry? Here. Commissioner Reed? Here. Commissioner Traeger? Here. Mayor Derek L. Henry? Here. Uh, to, uh, tonight, we have a number of America's finest uh, with us, our veterans, and we are always uh, appreciative of your presence in the chambers and appreciative of your service in defense of our nation. Um, we as a nation uh, have a lot going on. And with all that is transpiring in our country and, uh, and abroad, uh, we, we have even more to be grateful for. And it's not lost on me, and I doubt that it's lost on any of you, of just how much we have to express gratitude for. Um, our freedom is, comes with a cost. And tonight, as we do before all commission meetings, we will pray, and I ask that Commissioner Henry would lead us in our invocation, mm -hmm. and Commissioner May will lead us in our pledge of allegiance to our flag, but following, uh, uh, preceding the invocation, I would ask uh, that a minute and 30 seconds be placed on the timer, and that we as a community uh, honor our fallen heroes in Afghanistan, the 13 who paid the final and highest measure of service and sacrifice in our defense. So again, we appreciate your presence. We realize that you are here on another matter, but your presence just makes this uh, all the more, uh, I think, appropriate and befitting. So if uh, Commissioner Henry would lead us in prayer and we would follow that, at this time. Let's bow our heads, please. Gracious and eternal Father, we thank you for this opportunity to gather today. We thank you for this time. We ask and pray, Heavenly Father, that you will lift up every service member, the family of every service member, who lost their lives bravely defending our country. We ask and pray, Heavenly Father, that every member, every member of the United States that was affected by September 11th, every family member, every service member, 
every police officer, every firefighter, every first responder. We ask and pray, Heavenly Father, that you comfort them today. Lift their minds and lift their hearts. We ask and pray, Heavenly Father, that you will continue to guide us, that you will continue to protect every person that decides to serve our great nation. We appreciate them, Heavenly Father. We ask and pray, Heavenly Father, that you will continue to direct us to be the very best citizens that we can, to constantly take care of one another, to be mindful of everything that, that, that we all have experienced and that those who have experienced great loss. We ask and pray, Heavenly Father, that you lift up the family of our, our police officer who lost his life to COVID. We ask these and all blessings in your son Jesus' name, we pray. Amen. 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 I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. If you would, one minute and 30 seconds of silence and homage in honor of our fallen soldiers. Thank you. We'll now move on to item number four, which is approval of the minutes of the August 18, 2021 business meeting of the Community Redevelopment Agency. So moved. Well, we have a motion from Commissioner Traeger and a second from Commissioner May. Do we have any questions or comments regarding this matter? All those in favor, approval of the minutes, let it be noted by saying aye. 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 Those who are in opposition, same sign. Motion carries 6-0. Now move on to uh, item number five is our agenda approval. If there are any changes, our city manager will read them at this time. There are no changes. Motion to approve. Second. We have a motion and a second. Um, no further questions or comment. All those in favor, let it be noted by saying aye. 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 Those opposed, same sign. Motion carries 6-0. Okay, we'll now move on to item number six, which is our administrative items. Item number 6A is the city manager's office, fiscal year 2020-21, September budget amendment. This is a resolution. A resolution amending the fiscal year 2020-21 budget to decrease revenues and operating expenditures and providing an effective date. So moved. Second. A motion from Commissioner Reed and a second from Commissioner May, was it? Mm -hmm. May? Okay. All and those in favor, let it be noted by saying aye. 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 Those opposed, same sign. Motion carries 6-0. And for the record, I had no speakers for that item. Mm -hmm. Moving on to item 6B, which is the city manager's office, fiscal year 2021 
fiscal year 21-22 tentative budget for the Community Redevelopment Agency. Resolution, a resolution tentatively adopting the budget for the fiscal year October 1st, 2021 to September 30th, 2022 for the Community Redevelopment Agency prescribing the net sources of revenue in the estimated amount of $7,482,965, setting forth operating expenditures, transfers, and capital expenditures in the amount of $7,482,965 and providing an effective date. So moved. Second. We have a motion from Commissioner Reed and a second from Commissioner Cantu. And I do have a speaker for this item, Mr. Mayor, Mr. John Nicholson. Of course. John Nicholson, 413 North Cranberry Avenue. Um, when looking over the documentation, for the first time in... I don't know, 35 years, the um, money for the beachside CRA went down, and there's no explanation. Uh, the house behind me put on the market for 950000 So it went from 300000 to 900000 and property values went down. Also behind me at the other end of the block, a house that sold for one hundred and thirty uh, just sold for almost 600000 and property values went down. There is a hotel across the street from me that just went in that's in the CRA. That's part of a $192 million project that just opened, and the property values went down. I don't understand why the property values went down. So I asked Fred to come up and explain why the property values went down. And secondly, if we do have the $5 million, why can there be no funds available I understand we have to take two and a half million dollars out for debt, or 2.4 million. That still gives us 2.6 million plus that can be spent on the beach side, and all the numbers that I can recall is $56,000 for fireworks and nothing else out of the CRA. So where's the money going? So there should be more things happening on beach side. There are things we want to do on Main Street. There are things we want to do on Seabreeze. There's things that needed on A1A. They couldn't finish the, the lamppost, the little uh, shades, because we ran out of money. There's things that need to be done on the boardwalk. We ran out of money. So if we have this money that should be going in, and the railing from, was it, five years ago, the hurricane, is still not done because we don't have the money. So the boardwalk is missing all its railings because we don't have the money. If you look at A1A, well, you're not responsible for the uh, asphalt on A1A, but it's in terrible condition. So if there is indeed money there, even if it's only $2.6 million, it should be spent on the beach side on the things we need. Thank you. Thank you. That was my only speaker for this item, Mr. Mayor. Okay. Do we have any other questions or comments? Okay. Hearing none. All those in favor, uh, let it be noted by saying aye. 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 Those opposed, same sign. Motion carries 6-0. Uh, and that was our final item on the CRA agenda. Um, so do we have any uh, comments from the commission regarding the CRA? No questions, comments? Okay, that adjourns our... CRA meeting. We will convene our regularly scheduled city commission meeting uh, in just a moment.